Tabiso Matsimela is an electronics technologist who is also a custom power solutions inventor. He has created a special load shedding system which consists of various power alternatives. The 37-year-old has turned his house into a smart home where an emergency electricity immediately kicks in once the primary power fails. Matsimela has established an integrated system for all his appliances by controlling electricity through his phone. He is able to operate most of his home electrical appliances without touching them. The passionate engineer can also program his house lights to function even when he's not present at home. It all started when he relocated to his current place three years ago after experiencing constant power failures. I utilized my engineering skills to do various or custom engineering solutions. I made sure that my systems or object my system doesn't tamper with the <coughs> electric, existing electrical wiring, meaning that uh, I don't have additional plugs uh, for power failure. So it means when power fails, I can continue with my life as if nothing happened. Matsimela says he's trying to minimize energy by these inventions. All his creations are custom solutions and not one size fits all. Amongst them is a mobile power solution that works with a rechargeable battery that can last up to two hours. Matsimela was awarded the Smart Energy Efficiency Project last year. He believes the current fluctuating power cuts can be resolved. I think we have, in this country, we have so many good engineers out there. There are so many people who can, if government can give engineers an opportunity to maybe come up with ideas and new innovation, I think this problem can be solved. And the other thing that one has to take into account, the maintenance factor. I think the maintenance plays an important role when you do your, your design. An energy expert believes that South Africans shouldn't be enduring the current devastating blackouts. Uh, we've seen of late recently that uh, ESCOM has lost well over 7,000 megawatts of demand that ordinarily would have been met by ESCOM, which currently has gone off grid, and that is comprised mainly of solar power. Uh, more than let's say the other technologies which will be that are costly such as uh, using diesel to generate uh, backup power during the time of load shedding but as more and more and i project that by march 2024 at least 12,000 megawatts of electricity demand which ordinarily would have been met by escom would have migrated off grid so that shows that indeed there are technologies that uh, are now being deployed which uh, are so advanced to actually offer electricity reliably at the lowest cost possible. Matsimela's recent research is a mobile and permanent spiritual load shedding system for traffic lights to reduce congestion while improving traffic flow. He is confident that the system can be implemented in the real world to improve traffic conditions. Rifilo Mekwa, SBC News, Bluefontaine.